hi loves welcome back to another video if you would like to see how i did my hairdo please keep on watching okay but first if you're not subscribed to my channel please go ahead and hit the subscribe button hit the bell so you could be notified every upcoming videos please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up share it to your friends and family share it to everyone you know share it to the world and um Follow me on my social medias on Glow with D, which is on Instagram and on TikTok, and also my boutique page. My earring is from there. That's Fashion Frenzy FL. So go and check out those pages. The links will be in the description box down below. So you click on it, it's gonna take you straight to my page. So you can go ahead and follow. And yes, guys, this style is super cute. I did it on my own. So if you're interested, please keep on watching. Hey love, so I went ahead and started the back of my hair. As you can tell, my hair is already parted out and everything. So I went ahead and did that in the beginning. And then I'm here showing you guys the hair I use. I use um, two pack of that and one pack of the, well not a whole pack of the pink. And just to let you guys know, I feel like the hair I used was not good. It was kind of rough. So I want to try this style again using a different hair. So yes guys, so I would advise you not to use this hair because it's kind of rough. And yes, I used the clear band for the pink hair to, um to wrap the bottom and the clear rubber band is not strong at all i would not advise the black rubber band was much stronger the clear one was busting and this is all the products i use that's like the lock gel and everything so i'm showing you guys everything i use in the beginning so you guys don't have to leave a comment asking what i use what hair i use what you know so I hope I'm not going to get those questions because I put it in the beginning of the video. <laughs> so right here I'm going to show you a slow-mo. I did the crochet method and I find this way was easier. So what I do is I parted the, in the as you can tell, then I'm going to braid it and then crochet it here into the braid. So you guys will see it in a minute, guys. This style, the hard part of doing your hair is not being able to see your hair, you know like properly especially with the pardon like you can t as you can tell i did my pardon before starting this video so because that took a while okay and i did it by myself it would be easier if i had someone to part it out for me but i i was home alone so i did it myself and it took a while <laughs> i'm not even gonna lie i was getting frustrated but yeah because you know you want your parts to be straight and you know neat so and that's what i was trying to do so as you can tell, uh, I'm parting, split, I split the hair in two. So one strand going to have one, the other strand going to have one. So basically when I twist the whole two lock together, that's it's, it's one. Hopefully you understand what I'm saying, okay? So guys, just keep on watching this um, part right here is basically for you to watch and hopefully you understand because it's going to be hard for me to explain. It is very easy to do. And yes, just keep on watching and I'll come back to you guys when I have something to say. <laughs> So right here, you have to remember, if you're used to twisting your hair a certain way, some people twist to the left, some people twist to the right. So you want to make sure when you're twisting the hair in the beginning to have that lock look, you have to twist it the opposite to where you're going to twist the actual hair, if you understand. Right here, I'm trying to figure out what side I'm going to do the little twist in order for me to twist the heel like you will understand because then if you did it the same way then when you have the two locks together or the two strands together it's gonna unravel and it's not gonna twist good as you can tell i'm doing the flat twist going left okay going left okay and then i'm gonna hold that and I'm going to do the flat twist on the other side going left as well. And then when I get both here together, then I think I'm going to be twisting it going right. You'll see. You'll see. It's kind of, you have to practice. You have to basically know what you're doing before you go and do the lock and everything. Because then you're going to have to redo it. So, yes.
okay so I did the second one twist um, flat twist going left and now I'm gonna take two of them together and twist going right if I took two, two of them and twisted going left then it would not it would have unraveled in the beginning so hopefully you got that that's a tip um, and that's something you have to remember in your whole head going that whatever you did the flat whatever side you did the flat twist then when you get both strands together then you will have to go ahead and twist it the opposite way so yes and right here I'm trying to level it to see where I want the hair to stop like the bob like and then I'm gonna go ahead and twist it going down okay and then go ahead and take the rubber band and make sure it's secure so, some of them I did one some of them I did two and I think this one I'm gonna take two yeah because when I feel like one wasn't enough I went ahead and do two because I don't want it to be coming out while I'm on the road or you know so yeah so I always do two well most of them I do two when I feel like I only secure the bottom and the top part didn't get secure so it's up to you though you don't have to do two use two of bands if you don't want to and yes guys keep on watching I'm gonna basically continue the process over and over and if you have any questions leave any leave them in the comments down below and I will try my best to answer as soon as possible and yes guys this style is so cute it is trending everyone is trying to get this style and yes so when I saw it all over social media I was like uh uh I have to try it myself okay let's be honest <laughs> and if you want to get if you are in the South Florida area and you want your hair to be done I will go ahead and do it for you just send me a DM send me a message or a comment or follow me on my social media and um, I have a specific page for doing here, which is Hair by Glowy D. That link will also be in the description box. So if you click on that, it was is gonna take you to um, my Instagram page, and you can go ahead and send me a message, and I will go ahead and book. We can book an appointment. So again, I'm in South Florida area in Broward County. So if you would like your hair done, send me a DM, and we can go ahead and make an appointment. If, as you can tell my hair is gonna look all cute so imagine me doing it on your head is gonna look even better because then I have more control I know what I'm doing I'm seeing exactly what I am doing <laughs> okay let's be honest so again um, go ahead and send me a DM if you would like to get your hair done okay this is called the invisible locks invisible locks and I love the little everyone everywhere I went Everyone was saying, oh my gosh, I laid a little pop of pink. The little pop of pink is cute. And I was like, thank you so much because I really wanted to do something different. I didn't want all black. And yeah. So, yes, guys. But like I said again, next time I want to try it again and I want to try it longer. And I want to, I'm going to use a different hair. I'm not going to use this one. So basically, I wouldn't recommend anyone to use this hair. So if you want to get your hair done, I'm going to send you a picture of a actual hair that you need to buy for me to do it I would not give you this hair to buy so again when I do this style again I'm gonna do another video show you guys the the newer version which is a different hair and the, I want to do it a longer length and the yeah so just and it's up to you to compare if you like that hair better which that one is a little rougher or the new hair I'm gonna use if you like that one better so I'm gonna give you guys the options to compare both hairs okay and I think that's it for now just continue watching and I'll see um, talk to you at the end
I was so happy when I got to that last that last section right there. OMG, that was the last one to do and I was rejoicing. At that point, I think it was about 12 a.m., 1, 1 a.m. in the morning, okay? And I had something to be that same morning. Like a, I had to be up like 7 a.m. So I was super tired and I was like, I need to get this out of the way. As you can tell, my nephew in the back is not out. He was sleeping over with me. So he was not out already. The bed was a mess, but poor, you know. <laughs> so yes, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, share it to everyone you know, share it to your friends and family. Don't forget to don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, guys. Like really, I'm I really do need subscribers. I really do need more likes and share it, guys. Again, if you would like to book your appointment, send me a DM and I will go ahead and do your hair okay and i hope i love you guys for watching i love you even more for staying until the end you guys know i love my side part so i went ahead and flip it over and look how nice that is looking the pink is cute look how neat okay leave a comment down below let me know how i did love you guys Mwah. bye